YouTube. Um, it's Lily. I forgot my last name. I forgot my name. So I'm going to be making a video on how to pull this in. On how to work in or break in this mesh or cross or cross mesh. Um, like, cause like when you don't use it and it's not fully worked in, it gets crusted. So there's like some stuff that you're gonna learn how to do and and like yeah. So the one thing you need to learn before if you're like a newcomer to lacrosse is that you can't have the ball like all the way under this. Like this is definitely not an example because it's not under it. It looked like it, but it's actually not. So if it's if you have an illegal pocket, that means that the ball is actually under this wire or whatever this thing is called uh, the, the piece of the head and yeah so the first thing you're want, you're gonna want to do is have a lacrosse ball okay so oh and some kind of shaft I guess I'm using a hockey shaft well you could also use this is not a lacrosse shaft but you can also use a lacrosse shaft, but something like, or you could use a pencil, something that fits in that. So this is for if you have a very tight, tight one. Very tight, very tight. Okay, so I'm gonna, in my next video, going to be showing another way how to break in, but this is my, this is just the simple way. This is simple, this is just the easy, quick way well, a day. It takes about a day, but you probably want to do it for a long time. But if you, I'll have, this is the day one, and then I'll have, I'll have three videos on how to do it. So, like, one, if I'm, oh my god, it's like 20 minutes. 20 minutes of my game, it's so tight. And I'll teach a really quick one. And, oh, I got, I got, I got some time. I have a couple, I have like a week before the game. But mine is so tight, and I'm going up against the great team that d destroyed, demolished us, or killed us. Killed us, yeah. Or just, just, just how do we have a good pocket up just all the way? So that, that's really that one. So the first thing you're going to want to take, you're going to take the, great, the ball and stick it, or like hit the mesh. Will it work that mesh? Also, just playing with playing lacrosse helps a lot too. Just playing passer, just like just stretch it. And on, um, like I maybe make four videos, cause video on how to make a mallet. Or oh, it's coming. Uh, I'm call it. Just like work that in. And so when you have it pretty flexy, probably want to do it for another more minute on mine. This is like push it really far out. And then when you have it decent, almost illegal, about. This is not illegal yet. So it's about so like close to illegal. Um, you're gonna take this, okay, you're gonna take it out, and straighten it a little bit, drop it in, and then roll it to where it was. Do that a couple times. This is so this it won't be illegal to make it so it won't be like illegal, and then you drop, drop it in, take it out, drop it in, roll it, flatten it out, oh, drop it in. Then you have the decent, then it's good enough. 
and you take you take your shaft and do this. Okay, the line is too worked in now. So it may be good enough worked in, or this is what you do. Stick, take, take this, stick it. Oh yeah, and I forgot about this. You do this too. You use it on the outside. Take this, you stick it. Take the little, take your shaft, put it on top of it. First, you're gonna drop it in. Okay, wait. Drop it in like this a little bit. Put it under where you need it. Or you wait. You probably want to use a pencil for this. Because there's a couple ways to do it. You usually stick it through the mesh. Oh my god, I'm such an idiot. But you can also do it this way. It just doesn't work as good. But, wait, let me grab a pencil for you. Right back. Right here. Back with my pencil. And we're going to scrub this super stupid. Whatever this script thing. That I, I didn't put on there. It's just a bit of You have it? Take this, stick it through a little bit of the mesh, cross it, see how I'm doing this. Oh no, this is a bad view. Man, try to like, probably gonna break it. Get it under where you want, where you want it. Take this. I don't want to have a sharp edge. Okay, that's going to keep it decently. Like that. Like, it doesn't have to be over. If you can get it over, that's, that's the best. You can get the pencil under or over the thing what you want to do, but you probably just break this thing, so. Try to do the best I can right now. And, yeah. That's gonna keep it tight on that. And, that just does some. And, so, that. And so, um, and you, you could also use this. It just doesn't work as good. Um, so, yeah, I guess. So, after you have it for about, let's see, just do it at night before you go to bed. Take it out, say, say it's been night. You probably, you got a decent pocket now. now. You have a good pocket. Probably going to be better than this. And then you're gonna repeat that, and you're also gonna. Well, so now it's the day you have. You take that, just, just keep doing it. If you have any shafts, stick it like this. Stick it down as much as possible, probably. Got you, then you're gonna be good. Just keep doing that, and then. Now you only have. Oh, here's the ball. Go get the ball. I'm gonna take this ball, I guess, and you're just gonna keep doing it. Oh, sorry. Just keep doing what? In and out. And. There you have it, you guys. It's all gonna be worked in nice when you're done. And I used this, well, I used it on my other, on my small, my other one, but got too small. And so that will be it. Thank you guys for watching, and see you next time.